And hello again, Internet. I'm recording a bit late today again. Things have been rather chaotic locally, but I still want to actually play this game. So let's go ahead and get it started here. Like I said, I do actually want to play the game. So even though I'm an hour late starting, I'll just go an hour late again, just like yesterday. So here we go. Now, one thing I want to point out about this game in particular is... Oh, for fuck's sake. The controls are pissing me off. That's not what I want to point out. That's just I should be a grateful. thing that happened. Um, this game, at the time, like, everybody's all, Oh, you know, it's an RPG. It's an RPG. All the magazines. It's an RPG. It was advertised as an RPG. This is not an RPG. This is an adventure game. It has more in common with King's Quest than Dragon Quest. And that's not a problem. Hmm. Hi. How's it going? What's wrong? I'm so thirsty. I want a drink. So get one. But I don't have any change. Alright, buy one for him. What I'll else am I going to do one. with all this money? What do you want? You're really nice. Thanks. What kind of drink do you recommend? What do you want? Hmm. Let's see. Well, earlier I drank the jet soda. So. Or jet cola, I should say. Hmm. Here. Thanks a lot. You've made my day. And apparently I got an achievement for that. Hey, shark. Yep, Shenmue. Is the restaurant busy? Ah, uh, a little. You should come by again. Honestly, it's kind of good timing special. on this. I was considering doing yes. a... Please give my regards to the tao -san. I was considering doing an adventure sure game. I'll say and hello, look, you. this turned out to be one. So there's nothing wrong with that. Okay, it's just that I've got to go. knowing that would have made it better. Do. Okay, see you. Thanks again. Oh God. You mean for three? Yeah, the voice acting in this is fucking terrible. But yeah, man, the voice acting in this is just god awful. No idea why. All right, where the hell was I going? I was going to the motorcycle place. Also, it's raining today. Interesting. Remember the day that rain turned to snow? Or vice versa. Where am I? Controls are awful. All right, Mike's motorcycle place is around the corner here. That would not surprise me. Can I get into this motorcycle place? That's oh, closed, isn't it? I, was, I don't think you can actually go in here open or close. So what what am I gonna do? Do I just wait here till the dude walks by? Oh, it's these two again. Um, got a minute? Huh? Get out of my space, schoolboy! What a bitch! Where is Charlie? Motorcycle shop for information. That's pretty early today still. Dog! Can you pet the dog? You can't pet the dog, this game is a failure! Hi. Excuse me. May I help you? Do you have time now, Hattori-san? Time for what? It? I'm looking for somebody. Do you know a guy named Charlie? Charlie? What, what's he look like? He wears a black leather jacket and sunglasses. I hear he's got a tattoo on his arm. Mm, I see lots of foreigners around here, but I haven't seen anyone like that. I see. Really? Because you're like three feet away from the bike. Actually, further away than that. 
How about you? You got anything for me? Um. Sorry, I'm in a hurry. No, you don't. Yeah, and it wouldn't surprise me that the voice acting it has to be intentionally like this because all the characters are like that. Like I say, it's a rather ambitious world they built. But I now know oh, why it's Yo. niche as well. Hey, Odio. Do you know of a man named Charlie? I mean, just look Charlie? at the facial expressions too. On Everything in this a is tattoo? so uncanny valley. No, I don't. I see. I wish I could help you look for him, but Yoshie won't let me leave work. That's okay. Thanks anyway. Ah, I might have to look that up. Oh, where's one of those maps? It's over here. I love how many buildings don't show up on this map, too. Like, the bike shop's not on the map. The game store's not on the map. <sighs> kind of want to go shopping today. There's a cinema. What the hell's in the cinema? I'm, I'm trying not to do much in the way of side quest stuff. Oh, you're open. Excuse me. Hey. I'm looking for a guy named Charlie. Charlie? What's he like? He always wears a black leather jacket and sunglasses. Has so, a so much for actually on. buying anything here uh, at this shop. You know him? There's this guy who's always whining about our jackets. Like he knows what he's talking about. Oh, he's showing off his tattoo. I see. About that guy with the tattoo? Yeah, he came by four or five days ago. Ugly as the worst sin. Always showing off his tattoo. What a and loser. They, they're like, no repeat information in the same conversation nah, right away. Know. And don't care. Sorry, I can't be of more help. I see. I was like, the conversations are so stilted. And I don't think I can actually buy anything. Can't buy new clothes or anything like that. Well, probably could. I doubt I can, actually. I, I bet I just have the same outfit through the entire thing. But the stores all exist basically in order to get places so you can talk oh, it's to people. You, Rio. I heard you had a hard time. Yeah. Hey, where Are is you Charlie? Okay now? Yes. I feel a lot better now. Don't overdo it. That's Really? He's the one guy you don't ask about Charlie. The dude standing outside the motor shop working on his motorcycle and he's the one you don't talk about Charlie with. Ah, this game. Is this the theater? Where's the theater? I also hate that the subtitles aren't showing up for the buildings anymore, so I don't know which one's which. Where's a map? Is this a map over here? I wish there was a map closer to here. There's one. You are here. Down and around the corner is a cinema. I mean, the next option is to literally just run around until I find Charlie. 
This is the cinema. This would be the cinema. Well, I guess I don't get to watch a movie then. Lame. Oh, God. Movies would be in practically real time in this, wouldn't they? Since you can't time skip... Is there a motorcycle shop in a different part of town? I figured it'd be something like the Grand Theft Auto series, man. Go to the theater, get some clips, bits and pieces of something. You leave the theater a couple hours in-game later. But in this one, you can't do that. You'd have to actually watch the damn movie. So there's a motorcycle, there's a motorcycle. I should talk to some more people. God damn it, just Is there a motorcycle shop somewhere that I don't see? It ain't gonna be up here. What the fuck? Okay. Whoops. There's not gonna be a motorcycle shop here either. If I talked to the kid, he would probably tell me about dirt and what it tastes like. Oh, look, the bitches are over here now. You, where's Charlie? Excuse me. Huh? Me? Do you know a man called Charlie? I know him, but, uh, you got a beef with him? No, it's just... That punk. Is he hanging around here these days? Guess he didn't get the message last time. Oh. Did it give me more information than that? For fuck's sake! You sound like you actually have information! This game is sapping my will to live. And the controls are just so bad. Oh, unfortunately, Shark, you're not wrong. So you're working on the bike. No one's out here for these bikes. This has got to be... It, yeah, see? Motorcycle shop. Excuse oh, me. Oh. Terribly sorry, but... See, I'm rather tuckered out at the moment. So this is the motorcycle shop. And you can look up at the sign, right? If I turn, turn around... Yes. Okay, yay! So he's got to be around here at some point. But when? I mean, it's out, It's noon now. Dude, I swear, if we're here all day and he doesn't show up... Yeah, yeah, the whole game is. I mean, we know this. We know this. No, no, look. Yes, the Chinese restaurant, thank you. Wait, isn't that what town? Like, isn't this where I was told to go about the dude with the with the drink? Tao san. Yes. I'm looking for someone. Ever heard of a guy named Charlie? Oh, Charlie. What's he look like? He wears a pair of sunglasses and a black leather jacket, 
and he's got a tattoo on his arm. Hmm, nope. Don't know him. Right? No, no idea. I see. I love that people keep asking what he looks like, and instead of describing him, they des he describes the clothing. Which, you know, fair enough. People can be identified by what they wear. Hi, you. Hey, I recognize you. We talked earlier. <sighs> they really don't, though, Shark. That's one of the things about this game. They didn't really duplicate NPCs. You know, um... Wow, I read that at Smelly Flower Shop at first. Okay, so that's how you get the tags back. You look at the things. Wait, does that... Oh my god. Hold on, hold on. I gotta test this. I've got to test this. Let's go to one of these apartments that has the tag on the door. Okay, these things don't have the tags on the door. I gotta go back to the other place. Wow, you walked across the street. I'm impressed. I also do appreciate that it slows down before you get to the thing. Okay. It does not. Alright. I was going to say, does that make the tags actually be readable too? Yeah, that's the part I'm at right now is where the hell is Charlie? Because he's not at the motorcycle shop he's supposed to be. So I'm basically at the section now where it's talk to everybody part of the video game. Stupid adventure games. Why can't he be where he's supposed to be? Have you heard of a guy named Charlie? Charlie? He always wears sunglasses and a leather jacket. I think I've seen Hello. him on the street. Really? Yeah, but there are dozens of guys like that around here. He's got a tattoo on his arm. Haven't had yep. any customers like that. First playthrough. I mean, it is not the first time I've tried playing it. I tried playing it back on Dreamcast and was bored to tears. It's not going any better. Although the fact that I'm more ready for an adventure game instead of an RPG as it always used to be advertised is helping. Charlie is supposed to be here, right here. Where is he? Nope. Gotta play him in order, man. Always gotta play him in order. So you're still Excuse walking me. around. Yes, what'll it be? There's something I need to ask you. Big, Excuse big me. difference. I'm pretty busy at the moment. They're, they're completely different genres. I love the people just appearing out of thin um, air also. Not I'm you. Just trying to I'm talk to the now. other sorry. dude. Bye now. Why do you have pink hair? You, pink hair. 
Excuse me. Hello, what can I do for you? I'm looking for a guy named Charlie. What's he like? He wears sunglasses, a black leather jacket, and has a tattoo also. Uh-uh. I don't know him. I see. Well, this is after 96. I mean, the Dreamcast came out in 99. Well, the thing was originally designed to be a multi-part epic. Shinkichi-san. Like, hey, I think it was 17 discs back in the Dreamcast day. Charlie. The first game was three Gary, discs. The next game was he? three discs. He always wears a black leather jacket and sunglasses. And they, of course, never finished it. And I hear he's got a tattoo on his arm. Oh, you mean... You know him? Nah, I just hear rumors. Word is he's a pretty nasty piece of work. Not the type you want to get involved Give me with. more of the information than there's rumors, please. Like, you guys are teasing that you have information, and then you give me nothing. I mean, it was, and it was also a failure. Tom. Hi, Dio. I mean, yes, it was very... I'm looking for a guy named Charlie. Do you oh, know him? God. I, Charlie? My brain is he dying right now because of this game. He jacket and has a tattoo on his arm. No, I don't know him, man. Really? Like, my brain is actually dying because of this game. There's a word that I have been using for the past two days to describe the game, and I don't remember the word right now. Kurita-san. Like, Yo, he reached. He was definitely reaching. Do you know a man named Charlie? But... Huh? Charlie? Wears a black leather jacket, sunglasses, and it has is a impressive on world. It is. I see that guy out in front of the shop sometimes. Which shop? Always ragging my merchandise, like he'd ever buy anything. Huh. This shop. When so where is he? Come around. He usually heads over this way after hitting the jacket shop. You know, man, guys like that almost always look around without buying anything. You're talking to another guy who hasn't bought anything. <laughs> That's because Shenmue 3 was the same game as the other two. Because the other two are pretty mediocre as well. Yes. Do you know a man named Charlie? That's the thing, man. I, I don't know what people were expecting Charlie, from 3. I know Charlie Chaplin, but he's no longer with us. I assume you mean someone local? Oh, you probably could. Yes. Someone alive You'd also see just how gray my hair has become he while has doing this. Hmm, I have no idea. I see. Like I say, they, they, they tried. They, Hi. Well, I'm glad the game you? exists because you know of what came Charlie? after. Charlie. Having this Never game with him. this type of a He's big a immersive world, which uh, it may look like a small immersive world. Him. I see. But this, as hey, said, was huge you at the time. I got some fresh loaves of bread, hot from the oven. No thanks. Maybe next time. Okay. And I mean, like I said, this world is huge. The amount of interactivity and stuff you can do with it at the time was massive. And this is kind of... I mean, like I said... Thanks to this game, we got the Yakuza series. And I will forever be thankful to this game for that. And I've only played two of the Yakuza games, and I'm still in the middle of the second one. But the very fact of just how good Yakuza 0 was... Oh... Yeah. Yeah, this is... It's like Quake. I don't like Quake 1. This is not a secret. I do not like Quake 1. I don't think it's, as a game, very good. I think even the engine itself is pretty clumsy stumbling block with early 3D where you can't distinguish things. Now you're on this one? So which bike is yours, old man? Or you? I, actually, you might be the one who owns the shop. Ono-san. Hey, Ryo. 
But because of Quake you know One, a guy named Charlie? we did Charlie? get a lot better you know games him? after. He's such a poser. Thinks riding Wait, a hog what? makes him look cool, but what? I don't. I, you're the same person I talked to earlier. Literally. Do you know where he lives? No idea. He only stops by sometimes. Oh yeah, go to Tsuruoka's place. You mean Tsuruoka son at the jacket shop? I heard Charlie goes there sometimes. Yeah, I've already been Thank there. You. Why is that? I've already been there. That's what I mean when I say this game just eats at your soul. Hi, Excuse again. Me. Hey. I'm looking for a guy named Charlie. You know, Charlie, the guy I asked you about earlier. Like? He always wears a black leather jacket and sunglasses. Has a tattoo on his arm. Ah, you know him? There's this guy who's always whining about our jacket. Same conversation like as last time. Talking about. Always showing off his he tattoo. He was here four or five days I ago. See. About that guy with the tattoo? Yeah, he came by four or five days ago. Ugly as the worst sin. Always showing off his tattoo. What a loser. Know where I can find him? Nah, I wouldn't know and don't care. Sorry, I can't be of more help. I see. Yeah, see? Go talk to the guy at the jacket shop. There's nothing to talk to. I already did. You stupid notebook. Why are there two blank pages? Oh boy. This is another jacket. Oh shit. Do I have to go to like Water Dragon or. Sports Hitari? Probably that one. No. Because this is another problem. There ain't no other jacket shop on this list. Half the buildings aren't freaking listed on these things. So what's the point of having this? It lists one jacket shop. And it has the name backwards. Jackets Jupiters instead of Jupiters Jackets. Oh, this game. This game is so bad. I mean, like I, said, I know why this has a niche audience. It's an adventure game, and adventure games have always had niche audiences. And there's nothing wrong with that. All right, let's see what you have. You have any information? You sell jackets. I know. I'll make a nice patch special order. One with a lot of colors. Maybe next time. Okay. Apparently, that guy does drugs. Travel agency. Movie theater, which is defunct. No, I talked to the dude at Water Dragon Thrift Store. That ain't it. No, that is what an adventure game is. That's the problem. This was not the sports place. I am not seeing another jacket shop. Turn no, stop, stop turning around, you idiot. These camera controls are so bad. Another water dragon. How about you? No, I already talked to you. And a barber shop. Wait, I hear a motorcycle. Oh, damn it. I'm 
would have been too easy if the dude was somewhere revving his motorcycle. That's a flower shop. That's not jackets. That's not jackets. That's closed. That's closed. No, the problem is trying to look around and move at the same time. Because it's got tank controls, it, it just kind of spins your character around. I mean, military surplus, I talked to you Wait, already. Desa. About Charlie? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It must have been about 7 o'clock. Came out of the jacket shop. Like he's on his way out to go have a good time or something. I see. Thanks. The dip. Seen it. Jupiter's jacket! See? Jupiter jacket. 7 o'clock, huh? Are you the wrong person at the jacket shop? Is that the problem? Uh, well, we're at what, five o'clock right now? More flowers. Tobacco shop. Why is there a kid at the tobacco shop? What Hi. is going on here? Hey, mister! Wanna play with me? Some other time, okay? Why is there a kid at the tobacco shop? I don't- No, 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 no! You idiot! Good, I got my money back. Jacket shops back here, are there? What is this? Noodles. Oodles of noodles. Oh, thanks for the follow. You get to see me f be very frustrated as I play a game. Why do you keep disappearing? It's a magical disappearing shopkeeper. Probably because this angel, angel, and Jin can't handle that many people at once. So they keep phasing in and out of existence. Uh, Friday, the twelfth. No, the fifth. Well, it's almost five o'clock. Oh, that's probably it, isn't it? It's a different employee on a different day. That would not surprise me in this game. Well, it comes out of Jupiter's jacket. It's around seven. So let's park my butt here and wait. And you can watch my butt shake back and forth in the idle animation. Which actually, the butt's the only thing that stands still. His weight shifts back and forth, but the butt stands still. It's almost hypnotic. Oh, I probably will since I haven't done any of the side quest stuff. I even let the cat die. I'm not surprised that an adventure game has multiple endings. I'm not going anywhere to buy stuff. I don't want to play darts. I don't even want to kill time. I hate going to the arcade things. Right, you know what? 
Uh. Um. What is it, kid? I swear to God, are you Charlie? I need to ask you something. Forget it. Um. Who the hell do you think you're talking to? You Charlie. Me? I've got a question for you. Who are you kidding? I will hurt you. Nope, I'm just gonna fucking stand right here. Um, what you want? I want to ask you something. Phew, you sure got nerve. Go on, kiss off, punk. I mean, tattoo on the arm, sunglasses, it's not black leather though. Or a jacket, it's just a vest. But it would make sense. And thanks for the follow. Time it. Time is it in game? Yeah, I don't know how long darts takes. One game, one hundred yen. Yeah, screw it. I'll play it once. I'll try it. I'll try it. Let's see how terrible I am at darts. Darts are better than Yakuza. Yeah. I'm getting it. Really? So there close. we go. Oh, ah, good. dang it. A little bit off. This is the last dart. We get five darts? I was expecting three. No, good. Way off. Wait, that's an 18, isn't it? No. Oh, come on, that's on the 18. Hell with you on that. Whoa, the high score. Game over. That's enough for now. Well, I do appreciate that the watch is on screen when I'm doing the mini games. That's handy. Because I was playing Outrun, I was able to watch the time actually go by. I don't like that it has to be done in real freaking, or, you know, not exactly real time, but that you really can't pause it and. Or just, you know. Go, I'd like to wait two hours. No, no, you have to actually play the game. Darts, seven. You have five darts. Uh. See, that would be something, except I don't have that yet. Said that one's out of order. I'd play that. Oh, what do we got in the jukebox? Maybe just one song. Nah, not going to play it. Nah, just don't have time. Not today. But later I will. Yeah, listening to music, especially if they pulled music from other games, great way to kill some time. Well, it's not seven yet, but... How about you? Can I talk to you? Do you have anything to say? No, Yuki. Yeah. 
I'm looking for someone. A guy named Charlie. You know him? Charlie? No, I don't. What does he look like? Wears a black leather jacket and sunglasses. Rides a motorcycle too, I heard. Alright, you have the transition eh? at 7, okay. Do you know anything about Charlie? I don't know him. But you said the guy's a biker, right? Mmm, apparently so. Then he probably frequents the motorcycle shop, right? You'd think that- The motorcycle that... shop? Past the Ajiichi? Yeah, man. Just ask Ono-san. He might know about him. I'll give it a try. Thanks. Yes, ask the people you've already talked to. I like that one of the reasons they do that scene is so they can reset the NPCs if they're in the wrong places. It's a good idea. I mean, for as much as they try to make this a living world where the characters run through their routine. Gee, haven't heard that one lately from something like Cyberpunk, huh? Yeah, it having the thing like that lets them reset stuff. A little behind the curtain stuff. So this has been a waste of an in-game day, basically. Oh, we're almost there. We're almost there. Here it comes! Love that Sega sign over there. Okay, so it's 7 o'clock. Where's the dude? He's not here. Excuse me. Hey. I'm looking for a guy. Charlie, he always wears... Ah, you know him? There's this guy who's... Like, he knows what I see. Yeah, he's supposed to come out here at I'll 7. again. He ain't here. Don't see him anywhere. Excuse me. Have you decided on something? Do you know if a guy named Charlie comes here? He wears sunglasses and a leather jacket and... Sunglasses and a leather jacket? You know, I'm pretty sure I saw someone like that over at Kurita-san's place. The military surplus store? Yeah. Right. I, I talked to that guy. I talked to the military store. Not on the list anywhere. Not on the map if there is. So you figure he'd be back here. He's not. And of course, the military surplus is closed now, so I can't talk to that guy, can I? Oh yeah, I've been inside the bars. Not since this quest, though. Actually, yeah, since this quest has started inside the bars. That's where you find out about Charlie. Okay, you, military surplus man. Kurita-san. Yo, how are ya? Even though I've already asked you, apparently you I have to ask you again. Charlie? Huh? Charlie? Where's a black leather jacket? I see that guy out and always ragging. When does the- He usually heads over- You know, man, guys like that- I see. Yeah, see? Go talk to this person. Nothing there. Nothing there. He's not here. It's 7 o'clock. Nothing. No, wait, wait! We got us a cutscene. What's up? Hey, I know you. Nah, let me apologize for before. Good, what? where's Charlie? You know, you're a good fighter. I was impressed. So, I'm looking for a guy named Charlie. Charlie? <laughs> yeah, he's a friend of mine. Really? Yeah, you don't trust people, do you? Come on, I'll take you to meet him. I, 
I... What? Why? Yeah, we're gonna get beat up, aren't we? We got ya! Come on, tough guy! Show yep. us what you got! Look, actual combat instead of QTEs this time. His dad did run a dojo. So where's this Charlie? Or do I have to beat you even more? So, do you know Charlie? I I don't know any Charlie. Where'd you get the tattoo? Okay, now what? Uh... I'm not lying. But there's a tattoo parlor in Yokosuka, too. A friend told me about it. Where's the tattoo parlor? I don't know. You've got to believe me. <sighs> well, now I got information on tattoo parlors. None here, but there's some in other areas. Tattoo parlor location. Need to find a tattoo parlor. Well, there wasn't one in any of the areas I've been able to go to. So. I should talk to some more people. Oh, you piece of. Yeah, but I haven't been able to go to Okinawa. The only two places I've been able to go are here in the street. Because every time I try going further, you should talk to more people. You should talk to more people. Why is he not out in front of the motorcycle place? Alright, fuck it. I'm going to the bar. Excuse me. Hi there. Dead up. In the bar! Alright, fine. How about into this bar? Um, if you want to talk, come to the bar. That's what I'm trying to do! Goodbye. Well, if it isn't Rio... You again! Is there a tattoo parlor around here? So, they have those in Dobu Ita too. Hmm. Akimi-san. Oh, sorry. It's okay. Why are you... Are, Ask I guess she's, she could be very drunk here. He should know. Alright. Who is that? Are you the one? Do you have a minute, Saijo san? You are. Yeah, what is it? Do you know of a tattoo parlor around here? Yeah, there's one nearby. You getting a tattoo? No, I just have some business with a guy who goes there. What I guess there is a business? tattoo parlor. About the location of that tattoo parlor? What kind of business? Okayama About the location of that tattoo parlor. Okayama Heights? Run by a crazy guy called Takashiro. Can't tell by his appearance, but he's good. That's all right. Okay. I have no idea where that is. Just walk. I'm going to assume that's the bathroom. Hi, Rio. Why? Why are you talking to me again? Oh, wow, I haven't seen you in forever. You are so drunk, lady. All 
right, here's where bikers... Oh, hi! She really does. Now, well, those two are not Charlie. Do you have a minute? I don't know what you want, but we yeah. don't have time for go on. We don't have time for the likes of you. Okay. Where's that map? Where is that map? So I've been to there, to there. I'm in here. I need to go to somewhere else. I'm going to assume it's this way. But it's probably going to tell me I need to talk to more people if I try. Far right corner? Oh! Shit, you're right. Where I'm standing! Good call. I didn't even freaking see it. I don't think anybody's in. That would be the tattoo parlor. I'll be damned. All right. Well, color me shocked. Sorry, man. We're closed. A guy named Charlie gets his tattoos here, right? Never heard of him. That's funny. He's been bragging about your work. I want to ask him something in person. That's so. Hey, man. Why don't you lose the jacket? What? Easy, man. I just figured you've got perfect skin for my work. Nice color. No sag. I would love to get the chance to work on someone fresh for a change. I'm sick and tired of those cheap, greasy punks. No, okay. I'm not into tattoos. Honestly, you know, get I one of the symbol on your Charlie. jacket. Hey, let me work on you, man. I won't charge you nothing. Come on. Now you've Say entered no. creepy territory. Oh, man. Too bad. I mean, it's not like you weren't before, but the... You know Charlie, oh, don't you? I'll do it for Come free. Come back tomorrow. Is he coming in tomorrow? He might come. Look, I'm close. Get out. Oh, return to the parlor. Tom. Who's Tom? Great, now i got to find Tom as well as Charlie? Yes, I know that means tomorrow. Go down the stairs. Down the stairs! I do love how everyone's drunk now. They're just stumbling around town. Time to get home before 11. That's not the right way. I don't think this is the right way either. Nope, not the right way. I'm amazing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, fine. Since no one else is going to take care of this damn cat. 
Oh, nope. I can't take one of those offerings anymore. And since I haven't bought anything for the cat, too bad. The kids wanted the cat. They can take care of it them their own damn selves. No, it'll be a valuable lesson to those children. go night night time so that was a day that things happened is the cassette player in here nope nothing in here There's a cassette, but no player, and I can't interact with it anyway. Ah, well, whatever. I'm out. Today's Mo money! God, are those four areas the entirety of this game? Oh, I would not be surprised. Alright. Back to the place. Take my time, because it won't be open if I run. This is a video game that exists. I love how his shadow doesn't have any feet. Or hands. It is a very basic shadow. Did did Charlie? Uh, uh, uh. Like this has got to be the guy. Notice the other one just vanished as well. Although they don't do anything, they just sit there and wait for you to move. Very realistic. Oh, here we go up the stairs. Hey, look, it's closed. You see that? It's closed. It's not open yet. It opens at 2 p.m. Uh. Back to the arcade. That's too much work.
Well, they wanted to make sure that you realized how this game did the real time. No standing around and waiting till two. I mean, you can, but it's literally standing around and waiting till two. You can't fast forward the game. Which is why I'm not bothering running, because there's no point. However long it takes me to get to the arcade, that's fine. Because it's going to take me that long anyway. <laughs> that's realistic. It's so sad that this didn't come out in the US, or the second one did not come out on Dreamcast in the US. And I had to import a European copy of it. See, I tried doing that and nothing let me interact with it. Alright, man. Have a good one. Yeah. Yeah, you can just fast forward time in other games. And I'm going to say part of that is probably because of how boring this was for people. Again, I'm glad this exists because without it, I have not yet, but I do have it. I don't have the sequel, though. How did... No, you guys had a motorcycle. That's how you got here first. You know what? Going through, my, going home and rifling through the drawers sounds like a good idea. Actually, no. Let's leave, see what kind of songs it Maybe has. Just one song. Let's see what music we got. Do some music and darts for a little bit. Hang on, main theme. Space Harrier main theme. Final takeoff. Antiquity tree. Flower girl. Dandy old man, uh, liquor, Bosnov, MJQ. Dandy old man, and magical sound shower. I think Chris Hansen needs to talk to the owner of this arcade. Seventeen is what I'd heard originally for it. And I thought it was supposed to be discs as well, not just parts of the game. See, I remember that. That seventeen was very... One of the things I remembered the most about this game. How it was supposed to be seventeen discs. And of course, the first one was like, what, three or four? The second one is like three or four? And this is Dreamcast size discs. No idea how many the third is. But it makes me think there's supposed to be four games. And I'm impressed if they actually made Shenmue 3 with that original script. No, I'm playing them in order. And I'm not playing the second one right after this, that's for sure. I always have a Darts. break between one things. Game, 100 yen. I have Shenmue 2, I mean, obviously on Steam, but I have a European Dreamcast version as well. Of course, my Dreamcast got fucking stolen, so I can't play that. I'll play it once. It's really easy to play imports on the Dreamcast. That boot disc that let you play burned games... It's fantastic for playing legal, um, legal imports no, as well. Good. Same people who stole my Jaguar. They just opened up my um, storage locker and stole fucking everything from it. It was pretty so bad. Close. I'm very unhappy about that. I've had parts of my game collection now stolen twice. 
No, good. Dang it. <sighs> I used to have such a good game collection, but I've had it stuff stolen from it twice. I had to sell a bunch it. of it. This is the last I, arc. I, on one hand, I need to hook those up again. On the other hand, might not be worthwhile given what's going on oh, in dude. my life right now. Hey, it's a record at least. I'm number one. Game over. There, I have a high score on both of these. The rest of you guys suck. My all-time favorite game would be Fallout. Fallout 1 and 2. However, Yakuza 0 is up there. I played Yakuza 0 not too bad, not too long ago, and it's a generational masterpiece as far as I'm concerned. Like that's one of those ones that's up there with Symphony of the Night. You know, I don't know many other games I'd put on that pedestal. I haven't played Vesperia yet. Is this gonna be Who do you think you are? That's Nozomi's voice. Alright, looks like I gotta go harass somebody. Charlie, well, you bastard! Oh, brave. You must not know who we are, eh? Oh, it's you two fucks you again? You, you can't threaten little kids. So you think you're pretty tough, eh? Why the so greaser look, anyway? In the face with that toy. So we're gonna teach him a lesson. Can't you just leave him alone? He's just a kid. Hey, you're kinda cute, babe. Wouldn't you like to party with us? Get away from Don't me. Don't fight it, babe. We'll be gentle. All right, now they're rapists. Let's kill them. This will be fun. Nasomi. What? Are you looking for a fight? I'll respond to the chat in just a bit. Any time. Are we gonna have an actual fight fight? Not even a quick time event, okay. Wow, these guys are actually better than the other ones were. I mean, I'll, I'll at least admit decent fighting mechanics in this. I mean, if you read the list, you got a lot of moves, too. Both of you, stay away from her, understood? Yeah, okay. Thank you, Ryo. Resident Evil games. Again, ones that I haven't actually played through the series yet. I've done... Only, Zero, one, and two. Careful. They were going to hurt him. The remake of two was amazing. I know, but you can't reason with those guys. But I do have the remake of three. It's one that's on the okay. list. I was actually honestly kind of torn between playing that or this, but I decided Shenmue would be more valuable to play. Not that this is a better game, but. You can see more of game history in this than Resident Evil 3 Remake. Alright, you, you've been feeding hey. the cat. Hiya! Are you looking for something? Nothing really. Turn the camera more. Okay, there's just a box over there. Oh, she's the one with the cat. Okay.
See, I mean, that is one of the reasons I play some of the games I play, is to see their spot in history. Like I said, I had this game back on Dreamcast. I had to sell this one, but I kept the second one. Honestly, I couldn't sell the second one. <laughs> All right. Still got a couple hours. I am going to go my way through the Resident Evil games. Like I said, I've been through 0, 1, and 2 so far. Okay, I guess I can't go out that way. Probably not going to find anything interesting in the kitchen, but let's, let's root through people's bedrooms again. That's the bathroom. Let's not go through there. Oh, this game is so awkward. These controls are so awkward. Hi, nope, nope. Can't do anything there. Nothing I can interact with here. Is this going to be the useless hallway? No, it's not the useless hallway. Hi, I'm here to steal your shit. No, oh, wait, wait, wait. Wait, we got something. The door. Go through it! Zoom to interact with things? Okay. That might be what's messing me up then. I just figured I'd interact with them. Dear Ryo, those who follow the path of a warrior must be ready to die in order to stand by their convictions, live for one's convictions, die for one's convictions. Bullshit! You you gave up on your convictions and then died. It is up to you to discover your path and follow it through. You told him where to find the mirror. Okay, so that actually is helpful. Is that I wasn't able to do before. What do we got in here? No, no! Okay, I guess I can't do anything with that. Just closes it. Always maintain composure. No, wh why are you taking it down? Put it back. Put it back! Camera, why? Oh god, it's a chamber pot! Oh, God. Okay, now I'm seeing the level of interactivity that I was missing before. Is that a book of matches? Oh, God. Okay, there is a good level of interactivity here. I'm gonna have to get back soon. No, don't take the Bible. Cool. Heaven Dragon Earth Comrade. Nope, nothing on that one. Heaven. Dragon. Earth. Comrade. Fish! So at some point I'll have to take something off the wall. Fish! Alright. Okay, that actually makes a lot more sense now.
Thank you for that. Saved time. You did save some time. Thank you. Because I figured I'd just, you know, walk past and if, it's like, if I can interact with something, it would tell me I could interact with it. No. Oh, no. See, now, now comes the problem of the I must touch everything. Which I'm trying to avoid in this game. Oh, my God. I bet that's how I read the sign things, too. Nope, so close. It's closed. It's not, it's not two o'clock yet, dummy. Oh yeah, let's watch the sign here as it changes. Let's watch this sign as it changes. Get a good look at it. Almost there. Almost, and here it comes. Boop! They're here early. Give me something tough, so no one will mess with me. Quit squirming, yeah. you dumbass! Like that schoolboy. Shut up! He kicked your butt too. Yes, Schoolboy. I did. Huh? It's him! Uh, uh, oh, I'm no. out of here! I do love that they run from him. Have you come for a tattoo? You know why I'm here! I was here yesterday! He's over there. He's sleeping. We wouldn't wake him, unless you want to get hurt. Two of your dudes just ran in fear from me. What the? Damn. Now I dodged that. to know about the cartel I don't know why do you want to know that's none of your business Just oh yes tell me oh yes this is one of the QTE games okay let me go one of the arcade games is pure QTE it's even called that I'll show you when I get out of here I'll arrange for you to meet some of them okay that is the most ominous way you can say that, because you're basically you're setting me up for okay, a hit. Win. Tomorrow at three. Wait at the oh my god! I have your word. Yeah. You know what I'll do if you don't show. Saving me! What are you doing here? Class just got out. You shouldn't be around here. But I was looking for you. Oh? My friend said she saw you down here. But why? Today we had our college orientation. But you weren't there. Yeah. Have you decided where to go? Not yet. But if I go, it'll have karate. It's about time you started studying for the entrance exams. 
I'm a little busy trying to avenge yeah, my I dead know. father. I'm worried about you. You know what happened friends. a week ago? I understand what you're going through <coughs> with your father and all, but... We can talk about it later. Promise? Yeah. It's dangerous here. You should It's go dangerous home. to go alone. Take this. See you later. I am not looking forward to more waiting. Yeah, let me show you the arcade game over here. I played it yesterday. Almost got 100,000 points. Almost. It's such an iconic video game quote, man. I've seen it riffed in other games, like Lena's, whatever the hell that one was called, that roguelike Zelda I got into recently, even that one has that phrase. See, Excite QTE2. So they know it's called Quick Time Event. They're not even trying to hide it, they know exactly what it is. All right, so go home, sleep, spend the first part of the day rooting through stuff because I got to wait till three o'clock anyway. Also, I got to love that some guy who's known for always wearing a black leather jacket wasn't wearing the black leather jacket. I you again? How's it going? What's wrong? I'm so thirsty. I want a drink. Didn't we do this yesterday? Didn't we do this yesterday? Why are we having the same thing? I'll buy you one. What do you want? You're really nice. Thanks. What kind of drink do you recommend? I'm getting you something hmm. different this time. Let's see. Orange, grape, whatever the hell that is. Let's get you orange. Have some Fanta. Hmm. Here. Thanks a lot. You've made my day. Again, yes. I'm your hero. Worship is me. Is the restaurant busy? Ah, uh, a little. You should come by again and try Taosan special. Yes, please give my regards to Taosan. You're just going to keep doing this until I do that, I'll aren't you? Hi for you? I'm going to find you here every day until I go to that restaurant of yours. Okay, I've got to go. Got things to do. Okay, see you. Thanks again. Oh, there are coffees in there. I didn't even notice those. Should have gotten him one of them. Damn. There's there's two other buttons down there that aren't part of the other rows. You know, hiding. Also, I haven't had the soccer ball kicked in my face yet. I gotta check something. Yep, that's how you see the tags. Okay. That's how you're supposed to see those signs. So that's why I never saw the one for the woman. Okay. You live, you learn.
so I should be able to do one more in-game day. Is that a freaking crowbar? Why is there a crowbar? No, go in the door, please. Please. Okay, can I explore my room before going right to the bed? I can't even go to sleep yet. It's too early. Oh my god. God, it's too early to end the day! It literally won't let you end the day. Take the tape! No, take the tape. Take, take it. Woo! 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 Well, I have Shenmue now. Well, everyone has a recreational crowbar. Tape player! Oh, I'm so taking this. Woo! Ooh. It's a Sega branded tape player. I mean, it is my own. This is my room, so it's not like I'm stealing it from anyone. Memories. <gasps> Another tape. What have we got? What have we got? We've got... Shinhua. Okay. So, music get. Now look at all this crap. Nothing. Sucks! Man, that drawer sucks. Nothing but white t-shirts. <laughs> oh, wow. He actually has different colored jeans. I was expecting to have nothing but blue jeans in there. And his porno stash. Yeah. Where else would you keep it? Okay, so that's done. Someone wants me to check the baskets. I want my crowbar. No, give me the crowbar. Crowbar, crowbar, give me crowbar. It literally won't let me get the crowbar. I want the crowbar! I like the calendar on the wall. There we go. Phone book. In case I want to look something up. I'll take the flashlight. Then isn't that that is how everybody grabs a flashlight very carefully at the very end with two hand with two fingers. That is how everybody holds a flashlight completely normal. This game was made by humans. Video game made by humans for humans. It's human video game.
batteries. Alright, which of my devices needs the batteries? Probably the flashlight. Well, I don't know what aliens sound like, so yeah, because it did kind of go Russian for a bit. Da yet. And your Sega branded flashlight. Just didn't have a Sega branding on it. Here we are back in the useless hallway. Although I was wrong that there's not a door between the two. This is a closet. No, there's a door between the two. This is the most useless hallway in any building I have ever seen. Look at this shit. Unless there's a goddamn hidden panel back here. What is the point of this hallway? It goes from that room to this room. Which already has a door between them. See, this is why this game freaking took forever. Because you got to open every drawer individually. In the most awkward way possible. You see, other games like Red Dead Redemption 2, for example, you can open every drawer and look around in things, but they're much more streamlined with their controls on how to do it. It makes more sense. It's a dead body! Oh, no, wait. There's that photo again. What's a different photo? Where is this basket I'm supposed to be finding? No, I'm not stealing his piggy bank. Or his pencils. Off the room of your dad, okay. So this way. Unless it's like this one here. And there's that chamber pot. Pile of porn books. Lots of porn books. A shogi board? Well, I approve of the shogi board. Yeah, what's... Huh. What's this key for? A door, probably. A key? But to what? A lock. This oh, you may come in it. handy. Why are you stealing the key, dude? Dude, seriously. Alright. Once again with this mysterious, useless hallway. There's a basket. That's not the button I wanted to press. Alright, so look in the basket. It's a dead body!
Twin Blades. Fuck. It's not even under story items. Looks like a hand move. Oh. Oh, cool. Okay. So how about this pile of scrolls sitting here? Alright, let's take this down and see what's there. Nothing! I know, right? Let's pick up the chamber pot again. Oh god, it hasn't been emptied. And it's 7 o'clock, so it's time to go to bed. What time is it? Fuck. Can I please go to sleep now? Oh. Pot on the ground here. Well, you know what? Let's pick up this picture. See what's underneath it. Nothing. What the hell is this thing? Oh, it's a room heater, isn't it? Not a well-designed one. I have no idea what that is. And more porn. God, this place is porn all over the place. There's porn everywhere in this house. Yeah, it could be an air purifier. Except when this was done, 1986? Uh, I don't know, man. Oh, hi, you're here. I gotta admire the first Virtual Fighter poster here. In fact, I kind of wish that more of the Virtual Fighter games were in the Yakuza series. I mean, you know, we've got one and th we got two and five now. What about one, three, and four? as a whole, I'm kind of disappointed at how many arcade games are doubled up in the Yakuza games. It's like, come on, man. Sega's got a huge history of games they can pull from. Well, I've only been able to poke at it. It hasn't been able to really just grab my attention and hook me completely. So I'll poke at it a little bit, and then do something else, and poke at it a bit and do something else. There's a lot to do in it. I did Virtual Fighter 5 in my first freaking attempt. So there's all these things that I'm able to take off the wall. At some point, I'm going to have to take something off a wall, and there will be something behind it. In fact, this key is probably for that if I go to the dojo. Can I go to bed yet? Please. <sighs> no, no, I can't.
Although there's a lot more to do in um, Yakuza 0. It's just that where I am in Yakuza Like a Dragon or Yakuza 7... Yes! <laughs> Shark. Um, where I am in Yakuza 7, there's... I've got the management that I could do. I've got the hero quest stuff I could do. I kind of want to look around. I've been trying to look around town for more people for the management. Just haven't been able to find any. Hmm. I don't know. I don't know what to say. There, there's one in um, seven as well. Zero had nugget. Seven has omelet. Yay! I can sleep. Yeah, omelet keeps making you money too. Why are you so tired? Three p.m. today. Oh, we got stuff going on. Oh, it's Sunday. Father, I promise to avenge you. And I have failed! Yo, son. Oh, Let's okay. Let's for a bit, huh? Okay. It's been a while. All right. Okay, this is out of nowhere. Let's give it all we got, eh? That's the Fuku-san I know. Whoa, whoa! How's that? You were nowhere whoa. near me on that one. Oh, you... Nice block on that counter. I do approve of this, though. So get some training on how to do some of the moves. How about this? I don't know the moves for it. That was a good one. I it won't even it won't let me bring up the list for the moves either, so it's been a while since we practiced together. I feel much better now. H have you found something? I've got a lead on the Chinese cartel. Are they the same ones who, who killed Hazuki Sensei? Like everyone in yet. this. I'll tell you You're one thing the voice acting reminds me of. It, it alone, makes me think you? that you against those killers? everything in this is meant to be it's talking my down to children. Only option. I know how you feel, but it's too dangerous. Even Sensei couldn't. That's how the I've game feels. Mind. It's not realistic. But it feels like they're all talking down for children feel responsible. to be part of this. Don't worry which is entirely me. possible. No. But Ryo-san, is that shit. why you started training? <sighs> oh, please. I'm begging you. Please take it over. My mind is made up. I must go. Real son. That Please, could very well be. You overheard? Please don't pursue this, Dio san. I have to. Please step aside. I'm begging you. 
Respect Hazuki Sensei's will and look after the dojo. I can't believe my father killed someone. Do so. What? What? Please wait. There's something I must give to you. I mean, dude, his father kills someone, gets killed for it. Now you're gonna kill someone then. It just goes back and forth forever. Someone's gonna stop the cycle of violence. A letter? To my father? This came right after Hazuki Sensei passed away. I had a bad feeling about it, so I felt I should keep it hidden until today. This letter Why Chinese, today? But why? Because I didn't want you to do anything foolish and risk your life. You're Chinese, son. And because I don't want you to upset the spirit of your father. Mom, just let me avenge my dad. Inesa. Please, I need you to promise me. Yes, I promise. Cool, does that mean this game's over now that he has no more mission? Thank you, your son. Gee, I wonder how many Chinese people I know that could read this for me. Today's allowance. If she doesn't want me to go do stuff, but then she leaves me a pile of money every day. Yep, I figured there'd be a cutscene when it didn't let me choose where I was going. What were you talking about with Ine-san? Well... Avenging my father! Is that a letter? In Chinese? What does it say? Is it from the man who murdered Sensei? I don't know. Yes, hold the yeah, paper out in the rain! That's a great idea! we knew someone who reads Chinese. I like that he gets angry at the suggestion they need to stop that. Wait, do I have to? Where's Twin Blades? There it is. It's back, forward, back, you know, back, forward, forward X. There we go. I got time to kill today since I was going to use to this morning to root through the house, but I've already done that. Oh, it's adventure games. Water always does things in adventure. No, well, could anyway. Spar one round with no, me. I don't want to. All right, fine. I came in here to yeah, take things off the I'm wall. Ready for you, folks, son. Give me all you got. I mean, I might as well do this. Got to kill some time anyway. Kill a sparring partner while I'm Let's at it. Let's give it all we got, eh? Doesn't seem to work. That's the Fukusan I know. There it was. Whoa, whoa. Oh. I think. That was a good one. I can't get the move to work. Yeah, I don't know what's making it. I don't know how to make it work, man. What's wrong, Fukusan? That's it for today. Let's continue next time. I look forward to next time.
No idea. No idea. Oh, hey, cool. I gotta actually do this still. Huh? What could this be? What could it be? Uh, but, but, okay! I wonder what this is! Put the thing back and just walk away. Huh? What's this slot for? Yep. Huh, I wonder what this is. Walks away. Welcome to Shenmue! It really does have all the problems of adventure games. Because it is one. Woof, woof, woof. Woof, woof. There were dogs. What can I say? I'll tell you what I can say. I can say woof, woof. Soccer ball! What's wrong? The cat's dead. Oh, man, my sunglasses took my soccer ball. Told you it was a soccer ball. He said he'd give it back if I brought you to him. What? Where is he? At the construction site. You. I knew you That's not black. That's a greenish what? brown jacket. Remember the tattoo parlor? Payback time. Here, catch. Go home. What? What? Time to fight some more. Chinese? Yes. Oh, My don't don't make the kid read the fucking letter. What's your name? Ryo. Ryo Hazuki. Ryo Hazuki. Yeah. Say say Ryo san. can read this letter for me. I mean, you'll notice there's a lot of stuff that has been skipped in the journal. I do like the journal. That's a good feature of this. Ah, see? More things here for... Gotta buy all the capsule stuff. What time is it? I'm getting close to the end. So I am not gonna be able to make it to three o'clock today. I'm just gonna have to I'm just gonna run out of time. It does. The journal is well done. It does definitely help you keep track because it, it everything's in the journal and the way the journal is done as well. You know, I mean, there's the gaps in it, sure. You know, there's a bunch of, like, I apparently missed a whole bunch of stuff here. So, got leads, leads. That's pretty cool. We gotta be at the arcade at three, huh?
Is this the only arcade? And if it is, where the hell is my afterburner? Wait, you again? I go in. How did you get here so fast? Next time, okay? I'm kind of busy now. Really? By How did way, you get here so fast? You're Chinese, aren't you? Yep. I'm looking for somebody who can read a letter written in Chinese. My grandmother can. Your grandmother? Yeah, where is she? Okay. About your grandmother? Oh my god, he disappeared while I was talking to him. She's real nice. Where is she? At the shop. Shop? Which shop? She sells dishes and stuff. Um, Antique. It's called Roshia. You mean Loshia China Shop, Oh, right? China Shop, okay. The roof is red. I'll go see her. Thanks. Good, that'll actually be something instead of waiting till three. The roof is red. So let's look for a red roof to China Shop. Worst case scenario, I can always look for a map. Not bad. Toon! Map. Where's the damn China shop? China shop. There it is. Okay, further down. <laughs> All right, so let's go see what this letter says. That does not look like a red roof to me. Do you see any red on that roof up there? I sure as hell don't. Hello there, can you read this letter to me? Oh! Oh my god, what does it say? It's terrible, you're a horrible person. May I help you? It talks about murders and drugs and child molestation. Excuse and... me, are you Xiaosun? Yes, that's right. And you are? I'm Ryo Hazuki. Ah, uh, Hazuki-san? Oh yes, my grandson. Who can apparently teleport! Go and told me. Thank you very much. I mean, we've already seen him disappear and appear out of nowhere, so he apparently can teleport, which is how he was able to get around and talk to people faster than I can. Oh, I remember. He was so excited when he told me. He now aspires to grow strong and brave, just like you. It was nothing, really. <laughs> Come on, get so to the letter, get to the letter. Here? Well, I have a letter I'd like you to translate. Okay, reversed kanji. Reversed? Yes, but they aren't just reversed left to right. They're written in a special style. Could you read it for me? Nobody can! It's gibberish! Yes, of course. Beware of those who pursue the mirror. If you ever need help, seek the aid of Master Chen. Ju Yuan Da. Mirror, mirror on the wall. Ju Yuan Da. Master Chen? Oh, there's something written on the back, too. Tian Ji Fu, Jiao Tao Long, Ti Ji Mu, Wo Da Yo. What does it mean? Nobody Father's knows. Heaven, nine dragons, mothers. Okay, we've seen that. Heads. That we've seen. I'm sorry, it doesn't make sense. I understand. But I think this part may be a phone number. These ancient characters are numbers. A phone number? Yes. Zero four six eight six one five six four. Zero yeah, open four, to a safe, six, maybe. Eight, 
61564, right? Now, hopefully all this information will be in the journal. I've got it. Thank you very much. Okay, call the... Whatever. Unfortunately, the number's not in the journal. No, there it is. There's the number. Again, though, look at that. We skipped, like, two pages. However, those pages might be the guy we're waiting for at the um, arcade. So... We might have just done these a little bit out of order. So speaking of the arcade, I'm going to run back to it. But that's going to be it for the day. I'm not going to be able to do the scene at the arcade. Even though it's getting close to time... It's almost three. We're going to wait. And I will be back tomorrow for this. So unfortunately, I started late today, and it's late for me today, and I am hungry. I need to go have my lunch. Hopefully, I'll actually be on time tomorrow. Um, How is this game? Honestly, this is it's going a lot better than my first playthrough of it way back when this came out in like 2001. Knowing this is an adventure game helps because I've, I've actually been in the mindset for an, ad, for an adventure game. Like, so this, is, this is on the same style of stuff like King's Quest or Sam and Max, Seventh Guest. It's closer to a point and click adventure game than it is an RPG and that's fine. I'm okay with, I mean, I'm okay with this. It's unfortunately, in, almost always has been a nearly dead genre, except way back at the beginning, when, with so, so many limitations on what computers could do, which is where the adventure game genre came from in the first place. But once the computers were able to do more and more and more, there was no need for games like that. Until we get to this one, which builds the most immersive world they had at the time. And again, this was a very impressive, comprehensive, in scope achievement that he did. But this genre has always, or not always, but it's been niche. Even before this game was made, this was a niche genre. Like, the Telltale games today would be the closest to adventure games anymore. And even some of those are almost visual novels. So... Ah! That was a can hitting the floor. An empty can. So... It's kind of a shame this is so niche. I honestly haven't played very many at all. I mean, I have a bunch of them. I need to go back through and play, like, Back to the Future, the Sam and Max ones. The actual ones that were adventure games before they became more visual novel. And again, there's nothing wrong with visual novel style games. If that's what you're looking for. If the problem is when something is marketed as something that it's not. I've heard very good things of Walking Dead Season 1. Very good things of that. I just haven't played it yet. But like the later ones, your choices ended up not mattering at all. You were just watching a story play out. Which isn't bad if that's what you're going for. And then Telltale's went under. Which is weird because it seemed like they were popular enough. I don't know. Everything's awful in the world. What can I say? But if you know what you're getting into, yeah, this game is not bad so far. I am enjoying this more than I enjoyed it the previous time. It is still slow, plotting, and boring, 
but I've seen worse. And th the story is moving forward, slowly, but it is moving forward, and I do want to see where it goes. So there we go. Let's go ahead and make another day save here. All right. I will catch you guys tomorrow. Until then, take care and enjoy the games you play.